Hello everyone, it's Joy. Now is the time when I offer a meditation, a brief breathing exercise and a way to find a little bit of extra mindfulness and quiet today. Allow yourself to move, to find a place wherever you are, outside, inside, that makes you feel safe, that gives you the space to close your eyes or to just take a moment. For me lately, I've created some spaces in my home that I can just go to and take a moment, close my eyes and breathe. So this week, I've been thinking a lot about what we do and what we don't have control over. I know that many of us find ourselves, quote unquote, busy. And over the last couple of years, I've really come to truly believe that we create our own busyness and we choose how we spend our time. And as part of that, I've done kind of a complete overhaul on uh, kind of my time balance, making sure that my time adequately reflects the things that I value, the people that I value, the causes that I value. And it's a never-ending opportunity to reassess. And so as you find your way, hopefully you've made it there to some place where you can be comfortable. If you can, find yourself into a seat or maybe even lie down. And we're going to take our right hand and place it on your belly. And I want you to take a very deep belly breath right now. A lot of us have been trained over time to breathe more into our chest and not into our belly. So with that hand on the stomach, let it fill up with the balloon of the low belly, the mid belly. Taking a few rounds right here. And if you are like me right now and maybe having allergies, that's okay. Take a good sneeze. I had to pause the recording and then just come back. Come back to the breath. Then take your left hand and place it on your heart. So both hands should now be touching somewhere in that core center trunk. And it is from right here that we're going to do our meditation. And it is really on things we can control. The things that likely are the more important things in life. I was inspired for this meditation uh, by a posting from an organization called Becoming Unbusy. And this was written by Caleb Gunners. So take again your breath into your mind. And let it slow down. Things you can control. Your beliefs. Your attitude. Your thoughts. Your perspective. Take a deep breath in, hand out, noticing how each of these resonates with you. Things you can control, how honest you are, who your friends are, what books you read, how often you exercise, 
Bring the awareness again back to the breath in and out. Things you can control. The type of foods you eat. How many risks you take. How kind you are to others. How you interpret situations. Feel the breath come in through the nose. And if you can, open your mouth and let it out. (sighs) Things you can control. How kind you are to yourself. How often you say, I love you. How often you say, thank you. How you express your feelings. Feel the breath, especially in the belly this time, feeling it into the right hand. (sighs) Things you can control. Whether or not you ask for help. How often you practice gratitude. How many times you smile today. The amount of effort you put forth. This time, bring awareness to the left hand as you take a breath in and out, feeling the heart as these things you can control are stated. How does it make you feel? Can you feel any sensations in your body as they're said? Things you can control. How you spend or invest your money. How much time you spend worrying. How often you think about the past, whether or not you judge other people. And a big breath in and out, feeling the body right here, this present moment. Both hands moving as the breath keeps you here, safe, alive. Things you cannot control. Whether or not you try again after a setback. How much you appreciate the things you have. Let the quiet sweep over you. And maybe you remember one of that very long list I shared with you. One thing you can control. Let that thing gather your attention. That might be what books you read. It could be who your friends are. Give that some space to just manifest. Give it some space to expand. If it's the part about books, what kind of ideas are coming to mind right now that maybe need a little bit of extra inspiration or exploration? What kinds of books can you learn about? Go on Goodreads or go speak with a friend about what books really charge them up. Or if it's about your friend's Who is resonating with you that maybe you can connect with today? Is there someone you haven't spoken with in a long time that maybe needs a little bit of love? Or maybe you need a little bit of love and somebody can give that to you. Give yourself a moment to just let your brain explore. Meditation allows us that space. Everything doesn't have to be completely silent. (sighs) Bring it back to the breath if it goes off somewhere distant. (sighs) 
I'm going to close this meditation and allow you to sit with these thoughts. Again, if silence works for you, please enjoy it. Thank you so much for being here. Hope to speak with you soon.